This is a shield clock that I, I found on Marketplace in Columbia, Missouri. And my sister, who lives in Columbia, bought it for me. And then, due to price of gas and everything, um, I didn't know when I was going to be able to get there. Or she didn't know when she was going to come down here. Uh, she has friends that has a bed at her house that travel back and forth from here to there to Florida to stay with her quite often. And they came down in my area and deliver the clock now the shield itself is cracked even though this is a chain driven clock i think that it could possibly had ropes on it versus the chains and there's the bell works here's the penland port here's one of the weights here's the other weight two different size weights it is missing one door but here's one door and this door goes on and it's got this steeple coming through this hole in the door goes into that steeple and then there's these little bent nails that go through that steeple after the piece of wood is on uh, to hold that door on um, I don't know who made it but it's a uh, it's a very old clock and believe it or not it only cost twenty five dollars and so if you have the antique bug like myself and you find a wooden plate um, movement clock for twenty five dollars you should be stoked um, I love it um, don't know what I'm gonna do about this uh, shield and repairing it uh, probably gonna well it's gonna get glued but as far as uh, touching it up I'm gonna ask a friend of mine Julia, who's an artist who repairs um, grandfather clock uh, dials, what she thinks would be best. But uh, hopefully, sometime soon, I will be taking this thing apart, cleaning it, putting it back together again, and running. But I'm stoked to have it. Hope y'all enjoy this video. God bless.